And uh, she did say the vows. Uh, Ali vow. Are you planning on doing that very soon? And I vowed to you love did? Christ, yeah. <laughs> Alright, you vowed to love Christ. Alright, that's a good one there. But this is the iPad with your intro and you have a backup here in case this thing blacks out. Yeah. But you also have the bigger visual bit of I it. want that one. So that, that, that one. I say at a minute to Miangayo. Alright, let me give you space. Introduce yourself as uh, my anchor. I'll just do the producing. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is Niaji, Mini Giuliani, Nanaanka, Nasheng, Isa. So I need to start. Yeah. Betty Words, Dennis. Or oh, standby VCR, okay. KTN's new news anchor, Betty Chalo, walked down the aisle today, marrying her long term partner, Dennis Okari, Namjok Toka, Sjuk Tambo. Today's event marked the climax of six years, not one, six years of friendship that blossomed from right here in our KTN newsroom. newsroom. <laughs> okay, so Zinzi Kibiku reports. Weddings. An occasion full of love, dancing, and laughter. I give you my hand, my heart, my heart and, my love. and my love from this day forward. This day and for Katie and Friday Briefing anchor Betty Kialo, it wasn't anything short of that, Amen. as she said I do, <laughs> to fellow journalist Dennis Sokari. And on this day, the sun was shining, allowing perfect weather for a garden-themed wedding. The venue setup was beautifully decorated with white and a touch of peach. The wedding that Dennis and I envisioned from the get-go, because everything that we did is, um, everything that we wanted is everything that we did, and that's what happened today. So we're very excited that what we had in our minds is what transpired today. We're excited. <laughs> The KTN's team wasn't left out of the fun. From managers to reporters and fellow anchors, they all came out to shower the new couple with love and support. But like any love story, everyone is curious to know how it all started. Well, it started at KTN. In the newsroom. In the newsroom. This guy was teaching me how to read the auto cue because yeah. I couldn't do it at yeah. first. So... You know, he one really helped. Led to another, one thing led to another. But, I, but I'm the one who, the you know, made the first move. I'm that kind of a girl. <laughs> <laughs> the couple who are employed by rival media houses prove that love, in most instances, knows no business competition. Zinzi Kibiku, KTN News. And so, how do you think you fared? You look fair. <laughs> <laughs> All right, like Betty always says, mm. she always gives a score. So I'm thinking, maybe I'll give you five out of ten. Nah, no, nah, I wasn't sure any apple. <laughs> I nailed it. All right, I'll give you a seven out of ten. Seven, okay. Yes, yeah, not okay. too bad. And uh, that was a beautiful wedding that Betty Kialo had. A lovely couple. I wish them all the best in their marriage. Um, got any wishes for Dennis and Betty? Uh, Dennis. Morale, Yanni, strong. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, there you go. And uh, you're going to stick around with me. Um, we're going to be back with Willis, the word master, in just a short while. And, uh, well, it's a surprise word that you are up for. We have business as well coming up and sports, so do stay with us. This is Friday Briefing.